when you receive your autoscope, cut open the box. The autoscope comes with two plastic caps on each end of the camera. Leave these on until you have made your connector. Inside the box with the autoscope comes a sheet of instructions and the Harding connector which consists of four pieces. Open the bag and remove the components. Measure and cut the cable 7 eighths to 1 inch and strip the cover off. Separate the wires. Cut off fiber filler pieces. Slide the nut onto the cable, then the seal. Followed by the splice ring. Insert the three wires into the correct position. Snap the splice ring onto the sealing ring. Trim off any excess wire. Slide the contact carrier nut latch over the cable. Screw the nut completely down until the notches engage on the contact carrier nut latch. Make sure the interior wires are not exposed. This is the proper installation. This is an improper installation. Proper connector construction will create a watertight connection, avoiding possible corrosion and electrical failure. Once this is done and you're ready to mate the connector to the autoscope, you may now remove the protective caps from the front and back of the autoscope.